What's going on, everybody? It's Sunday, it's the end of the week or start of the next week, however you want to look at it. And I was thinking this morning, I was getting ready for the gym, and I was listening to uh, this nice little teaching. And the guy was saying, are you good or are you great? Because, hey, good is okay, but do you, do you, want, do you want to be just okay, right? Do you want your kids just to be okay? Do you want your spouse just to be okay? Your friends, okay? What about your God? Do you want your God just to be okay? Or you want them to be great? I think we all want our kids to be great. We all want our spouses and friends and loved ones and parents and everybody around us to be great. And if you don't want that for them, well, that says more about you. But you should want them to be great. And you should want yourself to be great even more. Right? God wants you to be great. Your family wants you to be great. Your friends should want you to be great. And if they don't want you to be great, it's time to get new friends. Because people will hold you back from stepping into greatness. Because you know what greatness takes? It takes work. It takes discipline. It takes killing that flesh every day. Putting down those potato, potato chips and getting to the gym. Getting up early and getting in the word or watching the teaching or going hitting the gym or turning off Netflix when you get home at nighttime and actually reading something that will help you better your future. Man, we, we gotten so lazy. Literally, people have gotten lazy. And not because they mean to, it's just because we feel like we're so busy all the time. Hey, I've said it, I'm busy, I'm busy, I'm busy. Yeah, and sometimes I am, and sometimes I'm just freaking lazy. And I don't wanna step out because I'm tired. But hey, who cares if you're tired? Keep pushing, keep moving forward. Stop, and not only that, but stop wasting your time with just good things. Stop, move on to great things. We get so busy with just good things that we never reach great things. And we think, oh, well, I'm doing a good thing. I'm doing this, I'm helping here. I'm serving this, I'm doing whatever. Okay, cool, that's a good thing. But are you, is it holding you back from doing great things? From reaching the level that you're meant to reach? To go to the level that God has for you? Because he didn't just make you to do good things. Hey, the enemy will keep you busy with good things. Because if I can flood you with a bunch of good things, you'll never reach, reach great things. And when you get to great things, that's when you start affecting people's lives. That's when you start changing how people think, how they look at the world, and how they change their own lives. Good things, nah, that's just like the appetizer. Gives them a little bit of food, makes them feel a little full, but only for about 10, 15, 30 minutes. And then they want the whole meal. And then the whole meal never comes because they just been stuck in the good things and never reached the great things. And there's another whole level past great things, but you ain't even at the great things yet. You still at the good things. Man, get up, go do something, put some time into yourself, stop doing all these good things and start doing great things. And hey, to do great things, you have to be great. So you have to raise your bar. You have to make yourself better. You gotta spend time getting yourself to that great level. Don't just be comfortable with the good things. The good things will always be there. And you'll live and you'll die and nobody will remember who you were. Move on, move up. You know what you're suffering with. You know what's holding you back and you're letting it hold you back by getting filled with good things and then saying, hey, I'm doing good things. So you can't be upset. I'm okay, I can sleep at night. No, uh-uh, that's a cop out, that's laziness. That's just being okay. <sighs> nah, and you won't be fulfilled. After a couple years, even six months, a year, whatever, you'll be unhappy again. And you'll be wondering why you're unhappy. And you'll give up. So push forward, get up, do great things, better yourself, go get it today. God bless.